Hello and welcome. This is an example where we have a hybrid vehicle uh, that is conceptualized in this block diagram. So here we have a, um, a few blocks showing, suppose here we have a internal combustion engine or it's also known as ICE, typical car engines, which burns fuel such as gasoline or diesel with air producing exhaust and it produces shaft work. So in this hybrid engine, this shaft work is used in a generator to produce electricity. And then the electricity goes and gets stored in a battery, which then supplies electricity again on demand to the motor. And that, that powers the drivetrain of the drivetrain of the car. So in this concept, in this engine, uh, the, the fuel mileage uh, in terms of the efficiency, in terms of electricity, is reported to be 212 watt hour per mile. This is how typically an electric vehicle reports its efficiency. Uh, so many watt hour is the unit of energy. Uh, kilojoule is the standard SI engine, but kilowatt hour, as you know, is the electrical energy unit that is how utilities sell electricity. And then we are asked that, okay, if that's the final uh, efficiency, efficiency of the electric uh, vehicle or electric vehicle part of this hybrid engine, how do you translate that to mile per gallon that we are used to, given that the ICE, the internal combustion engine, is driving this uh, hybrid vehicle? Obviously, the fuel information is given to us. The heating value is 44 million joule per kg. That is, you, if, if you burn one kg of this fuel, it releases 44 million joule. And the density is given, uh, and because uh, we need that to convert it to gallon, because mile per gallon is our efficiency unit here. So, also given is the thermal efficiency of 35%. That means if we have, a, let's say, 100 amount of heat is released, only 35% of that is converted to shaft power. And we'll assume that the generator and battery they don't have any inefficiency in this problem. So this is an overall efficiency, 35% that the ICE delivers to the motor. So let us see how to set up the problem. Uh, I have already logged in, uh, uh, in in test and also launched the test step test scale. Just to show you how to do that, here's another page. We go to the test step page, uh, test steps page, click test scale and go to the left tab, that's the, uh, the app. Uh, I have already written the test code to solve this problem, so I'll just go over it uh, very quickly. Uh, as you can see, the given variable, the efficiency of the electric vehicle part in watt hour per meter, uh, uh, watt hour per mile, is given 212 watt hour is needed for the car to move by one mile. Uh, gasoline density is given in kg per meter cube. Uh, and then gasoline heating value is 44 million joule per kg. The efficiency is 35%. So we, the, the, purpose, uh, the way we solve the problem, we'll find out in, if we burn one gallon of gasoline, how much heat will be released, how much work will be obtained by converting that heat. So to so do so, uh, we are, as you can see, the mass of one gallon uh, in kg is given by the, the, the gasoline density in kg per meter cube. And we, we use the fact that a gallon equals 3.78 liter, which is 3.78 times 10 to the minus 3 meter cube. So we convert the one gallon into meter cube and then multiply by the density to get the mass of one gallon of, of gasoline. Of course, as you hit enter, calculate, all these calculations are, uh, the answers are reported in the output area. So as you can see, gasoline, gasoline mass of one kg of gasoline is found to be 2.83 kg. Okay, so let's continue. Uh, so gasoline heating value is known in million joules. So we multiply by thousand to get uh, get it in uh, 
kilojoule per kg. So heat from one gallon of kil uh, gas one gallon of gasoline in kilojoule is given by this, and work from that will be simply that multiplied by the thermal efficiency, which is 0.35. So the work from there is in kilojoule. We are converting that into kilowatt hour because we know one kilowatt hour is 3,600. The pound sign is for comment here. And work from one gallon of gasoline in watt hour, the desired uh, unit in the, in the electric vehicle is only 1,000 times that. Well, now that we know the work from one gallon of gasoline in watt hour, we can easily find the efficiency in mile per, mile per gallon in that unit by dividing the work output from one gallon divided by the efficiency of the, of the electric vehicle in watt hour per mile. So the answer is reported in the output panel, as you can see, as 57 mile, a respectable 57 mile per gallon. Most hybrid vehicles, electric vehicles, they have very good aerodynamic shape, and generally they give much better fuel efficiency than uh, typical eyes alone.